Federal Labor continues to have a field day over the new blow-up between embattled Minister Peter Dutton and his old boss Malcolm Turnbull. As we enter an election year, the feud has further highlighted the bitter divisions in the Liberal Party. Another day, another walk in the park for Labor. Well, the year seems to be ending the same way it started, with the Liberal Party at each other's throats. The opposition enjoying a free kick after Peter Dutton broke from his family break to accuse Malcolm Turnbull, the man he knifed, of being a useless leader. A PM he claims was incapable of making decisions, campaigning or even selling the party's message. Today's accusation that Mr Turnbull would phone those he believed had leaked against him and make digital copies of their conversations. For most Australians, it would remind them of those Christmas arguments around the lunch table. The Coalition's junior partner still dealing with its own scandal. Unimpressed. Andrew's made the right decision. He is retiring for politics. The Nationals deputy keen to talk water safety but left to defend a growing list of complaints about the government's My Health Record database. Information securely in one place. With reports 17 people had another individual's private medical details entered into their online record. In a statement, the organisation maintains it safe, saying there have been no reported unauthorised views of a person's health information. Well, I think with any uh, personal information, we need to make sure that that is safeguarded. Already, though, more than a million people have opted out of the system. Tomorrow, Scott Morrison will try to use his New Year's message to start the year on the right foot, where he's expected to talk up the coalition's strengths of jobs and the economy. But within fighting ongoing, his hopes of making a big splash as leader are running out. Jonathan Lee for 10 News First.